This video is an update on the Juliana Loves Cat situation. If you have not seen that video, please go check it out before this one. She did hit me up with a bunch to say, so lock in with me. So she sent me a DM. Yo, I think we need a part two. It got a lot more people involved because she posted my brother and my uncle and messages I had with my boyfriend and my cousin. She hopped on a call on Discord too when I had her for a cool 30 seconds. It says, I hope you get that 50 bucks girl. That's the Juliana loves cats girl. That's catfishing as her. She says hop on a call. She hops on the call for like 20 to 30 seconds, but it doesn't lead to anything. She just starts cussing around in the DM talking about some scary A. Let me see what you really look like. A, you scared to turn that cam on? I'm not going to screenshot. Bro, just let me see what you look like. Let me peep, why you so insecure? She's like, so scary. That's a flex, but you got my whole family involved because you're broke with no money, no job, no friends, and no hoes. That shit just makes you look dumb. Grown B or something, little kid. Show your face if you so big. Go do some more of the shit. I'm trying to go watch some anime, not gonna lie, bye bye. Loser I'ma keep on to to my viz do numbers. Hey, accept the friend request if you're not scared. How would she get those? What do you mean, get what? The family picks? Bro, I made my spam public for a day like a dumb she stole everything i got a group chat going on where we got some people addressed we just not sure if it's her for sure i can add you to the group chat if it helps i just made that today so we're slowly getting somewhere i made a tiktok that 1k likes i'm gonna make a better tiktok explaining everything when i have the time but hella people are invested i have around 200 people requesting my spam just today and i said now nah, that's insane she must have a vendetta against you because why would she do all of this and go this far and that's just what i was thinking in my head because i'm like yo what is the point of doing all of this like the girl is literally telling you to stop and you are literally arguing back and forth with her what is the purpose she's like maybe very weird i'm gonna try to find her government in her face when it comes to like a catfish at first i was like damn that's crazy like you know ip all this Bro, this is a person using your pictures and literally posting your family. That's really weird. Like, I would want to know who the f is too. She got to do what she got to do. I can't post the girl IP. That's crazy. My only thing is helping her get the girl to stop catfishing. I guess this is the Juliana Love Cats girl, and this is her profile. This is what she posted. Y'all are so lame, I swear. Y'all be coming up with the same f shit. Oh, she's a bob. <laughs> oh, she's a bob. I literally don't care. If you don't like me, then skip my video. Like, you don't have to sit there in my, co in my comments saying, <laughs> same she coming like, up with what the is same this supposed to be chest shit. like what are we looking oh, at so mean and skip my then y'all oh, she sound canadian this is the catfish tiktok this is a story she posted a while back using an ai voice filter so she wasn't using a real voice she sent a discord uh screenshot of her the girl accepting her friend request and then her dming the girl some of the same screenshots we've seen before no you're fake you're not going anywhere using my face nobody want to you i'm glad you think i'm sexy as but that starts to get weird you're a fan so then what's the point you're posting about my face and body talking about i beat my men sad life and she's like so let me know what's the purpose of you catfishing as me you need attention that's what you looking like ducking the calls too said no nah, i just don't want to hear your high-pitched voice thank you like, i guess i'm trying to figure out who behind that man voice though let me know who man voice say you king kong let me see what you look like give me an explanation of why you can't be yourself i'm all ears girl ain't nobody has a king kong voice get off my page bitch. you spam texting me nobody cares what the are you here and then she deleted it said let me see what you look like give an explanation oh you deleted messages you yourself on god and they said on god back crazy i shouldn't write because i know you already taking screenshots show your face hello mayo on g ain't no point of deleting nothing already out of yourself i'm getting boredom now have fun with what the f i don't understand bye now need to go make a tiktok she said you'll never be me you'll stay insecure and sad literally bro i said the same bro it's like there's no point of doing it because it's like you're gonna end up worse mentally than you were before that's still not true at the end of the day when you go in the bathroom you take a shower whatever you're gonna see the mirror you're gonna walk past the mirror unless you don't have a mirror in your bathroom that's kind of weird you'll never be that bro you can't be somebody else you can only be you. all the discord messages was my only interactions with her and call was me telling her to turn her cam on she's saying she's not scared me talking and her breathing at me we sent her an ip grabber it says she's in washington there's an older woman that's involved she messaged me the juliana account asking who's real because she says she don't know who to believe last week then she requested my spam i blocked her on my spam and i seen that she messaged my main account on a new account after i came out with videos addressing the catfish so basically there's an older lady that reached out to her trying to i guess get information about the catfish and this is the older lady miss riri cookie and look, it says Riri. Look at this picture, bro. This is somebody mama. Unblock. I guess she blocked the account. The account private. Said lovely Miss Re. She got two accounts. That's crazy. Miss Riri Cookie and lovely Miss Re. I didn't even know there was two. She responded and said, 
Yeah, she only got 10 followers and two posts and yeah, they don't follow each other. So yeah, the real girl was posting on her story uh, asking people if they want to come inside the spam where she's exposing all of this. So this older lady messaged her responding to that basically trying to come inside of the spam that's exposing. On the person page, she only got 10 followers and two following, bro. I swear, if the older lady was legit bro i promise her page wouldn't look like this and she wouldn't have only 10 followers she'll have at least 100 i'm sure at least 100 people care about her at least 50 somebody care about her she gonna have some grandpa up here responding to the pictures like yo you look so pretty here you telling me the first picture you posted <laughs> is your profile picture i mean i guess maybe i don't know maybe she's just too old for that i don't know but it's not given that it's given fake it's a fake account i don't i don't care how old you are you're not gonna just have 10 followers and two following come on bro juliana loves cats yes so i guess this is her messages with miss riri cookie it says hi i'm from tiktok i'm really confused because this girl is so pretty and i don't know who to believe okay i guess they hit them up from a different account too with 200 followers because you got more likes and she said she deleted all her stuff that's random damn so she got hit up by two different accounts that that use the same person pictures this is juliana love cats by the way the old lady message juliana loves cat this is the screenshot yes i am that girl has her post before mine because i deleted mine don't listen to a word she says if she makes a video scene that's her then go ahead and believe that and they said oh okay i don't know what they hit up asking them but i don't think they asked for all that we searched the mama on facebook she's also in washington she got three daughters and when somebody messaged her on facebook she said this so this is riri the same lady who messaged her in instagram dms ma'am are either these accounts yours there is something odd going on she sent her both of the accounts that we just went over said or is that you the lady responded and said that is me but i don't know who abby is i don't want to get involved with anything I put my things on private because people keep DMing me and I don't know who any of these people are. It said, are you sure? And they didn't send. It said, there is 30 people in the group chat and I couldn't find anyone that mentioned me to her. I think maybe some people requested her account, but nobody said anything about me. Sus. The group chat is telling me to call the mama's IG to hear the voice, but I haven't yet and I'm waiting for a response from her. The Juliana girl recently started posting pics of my friends, but somebody who was on her group chat tried requesting her. So Juliana went through her following and took pics from people she knows. We also have guesses it's this girl because the counter in Juliana's most like video matches the picture. So I'm guessing they thinking that this is the girl. This is the real girl behind the account. I don't know how they found this girl, but they saying it's her because like the makeup or like the little countertop, little right here it's the same as this one that's what they guessing said and she followed juliana's new ig account and the new ig account is oddball kitten ah oh, so maybe that's how they made the connection what i thought you mean tonight 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 this is the catfish by the way just so people aren't confused i love boob this sh not good for your stomach bro don't let nobody tell y'all this sh good for you bro this sh not good for the stomach no way yo be careful with that shit, bro like is this even your pictures when a person is a catfish bro and they've gotten exposed i question literally everything bro even when when i see spam pics like this like is this even your Fool. like i feel like people can lie about literally anything she responded to my message because i asked if she wanted a video call she's like i can't right now when you're available again let me know and i can see if i can i would just be able to later or just voice call because i got work i said yeah i'm not gonna be live for too much longer but if you do want to send a voice message that would be cool too so that amount of time and energy put into this is sad as f bro a video would have been got rid of this bro why do people not make videos why are people underestimating a video the power of a video I got eight thousand on here i got five thousand on pinterest like people know my face from pinterest so it's just very weird that she's coming out of the blue and watermarking my pictures out of nowhere because people know that it's not me but a little bit of people don't know like i'm not clouded clouded so some people are falling for it like dumb a couple months ago she took videos from my highlights edited it with another girl's videos that I do not know. I've never talked to this other girl in my life and she made it as, look as if we we're on FaceTime. Basically, they said they got her. After all that, after all of that, they finally got her. I am an adult. I have spoken to my child and the account has been removed. We had a talk and I am putting their phone on lockdown. I apologize for the frustration that this has caused. As far as I'm concerned, this matter has been addressed. You and your friends or whomever can stop contacting me about this. All right. I said, so the account is gone? Yes, bro. Her is gone. Like, okay, so basically the only reason we thought it was the old is because that bitch hit me up last week talking about, hey, there's this girl, Juliana. She's texting me. I sent you the screenshots. I sent you everything. She said, she's telling me that she's real, but I don't know who to believe. You have more likes, blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to lie. When we were talking about this, we were thinking that the old lady was like Juliana on another account. The old, like the old lady was Juliana on another account as far as the Instagram account. I don't know what she was trying to get out of that. Maybe she was trying to get some proof so she can use that proof. I'm like, this is weird because this is old as fuck. She looks about 40, bro. She looks like she's in her... 40s like mid 40s what the f 
she doing on TikTok involved in my beef with this catfish, right? So I'm like, whatever. I didn't think too much of it and I just ignored it. Mind you, that was last week. And I had blocked her on my spam because she had she had uh, requested my spam. And that was before I came out with all the videos and sh I've been said I was in a doctor, but I never put anything into it. Like I never put effort because I didn't really care. Like there's hella catfish in me. But then this posted my brothers, bro. I put my spam on public, like on demo. And she stole all my sh she stole messages I have with family. She stole messages I have with my boyfriend. She what? stole messages I have with friends, with my cousin. She stole pictures of my brother and she posted everything. Like it's weird. That's really weird. So I was like, okay, cool. I have like a little people watching me and sh so I decided to make a video on TikTok. That should go like one point two thousand likes and like ten thousand views and shit since yesterday and a couple people hit me up i have like 300 requests on my spam but there was only 30 people that I added to your chat i had told them about the the page the old bitch and they were like that's very weird they sent juliana a link after i got on call with her on discord it matched the same ip as the old bitch well, we didn't know though right so we sent mm. we sent juliana's discord the link and it matched to washington so we knew she was in washington and then after you know how i said that i thought it was maybe the girl because the counter matched up we sent her an ip grabber link too but she's all the way in denver so what? she pulled it out we didn't think it was her either and then they wanted me to tell the mom or the old bitch they wanted me to send her a link but i didn't somebody else ended up sending her an ip grabber right it was exact same this what same, phone, same location like everything was the same bro wait the phone but it didn't make sense because it was old so somebody searched her up on facebook mind you her face matched to somebody that followed juliana on pinterest on tiktok on instagram and her facebook said it was from 2008 so it wasn't like like a random old lady like it was a real person you know what so they got her number from her facebook and they called her up and at first she wasn't saying nothing and then she started whispering I could send you those videos if you want but somebody was somebody um in the group chat started calling her and she was whispering saying like i'm gonna you this is not and then multiple people started harassing her and then i think that's whenever her mom got involved and her mom was saying like i'm gonna call the police if you guys don't stop harassing me but they didn't give a so they kept harassing her and <laughs> <laughs> yo <laughs> they're relentless bro i don't know bro that's funny as hell they didn't care they just kept harassing <laughs> yo what so they were like bro just be like text her and be professional about it like just tell her what's up they ended up telling her what's up that's whenever we see we received the text saying like all her accounts have been taken down she's grounded i talked to her and we went and checked bro and all the accounts are gone like we got we got this quickest like too her instagram i think her instagram is still there but her pinterest is gone her tiktok is gone i haven't heard nothing and mind you i have not put any of this information out if you look at my story that's all i've ever said like before i posted like uh my recent i didn't mention nothing about like her family and shit like her mom really told her delete that shit bro like we actually found her mother she's not gonna pick up hello yo hello is this the catfish yo why are you catfishing you fat old ass raggedy um, <laughs> yo, what? <laughs> You're sad as f like, be yourself, and you had to lie about getting food. Like, no. what the f fucking bitch? Go like, you <gasps> They didn't say that. They didn't say. Did y'all hear that? They say go go kill that roach that's in the corner. Yeah, go kill that roach that's that's crawling in your room. They said that. I ain't yeah, I ain't I ain't hear no. My Oh, go kill that roach! Uh, Why it's your roach. voice? Why are you forcing your voice, huh? Dad, no. and you're not talking either. Like, literally, stay go quiet, motherfucker. Go get a job. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they on her. Ass. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, understandable, but like, damn. Say go get a job. <laughs> like, they just spam. They just, I don't know. They spamming the insults, bro. Wait, is it your granny dead? Damn, not granny. Not the granny. Ain't your yeah. granny. Don't you live in Washington? Oh! Yo, I know this is this is like gunshots, bro. Boom. Don't you live in Washington? Ain't your granny dead? Hey, man, look. This is why you shouldn't catfish, bro. This is why you shouldn't catfish, bro. If she never catfished, none of this would have been happening. If she just left it alone, none of this would be happening. What the fuck are you catfishing? What the Get out of that, like. Literally. What do you get out of that? Like, and you're real quiet. Literally. But when and they just and they just letting it go on too. They're not saying nothing. Like, they just listening. I called you. You were all pressed. Find your house and sit outside, and then when you little babies go to sleep, I'm going to creep in. You're not scared.
scary. <laughs> Fuck, she thought this was. Yeah, she thought this was a Jeepers Creeper story. What? She thought this was. <laughs> she thought this was Goosebumps. What is going on? You so stupid. Oh. What the fuck are you whispering for? Talk louder, bitch. Get loud. Get loud. Find me in the shadows. What the? <laughs> fuck? Bro, you're a. What's up? Find me in the shadows. <laughs> <laughs> bro. Yeah. bro. It turned into their favorite scary movie, bro. Turned this shit into Insidious. They're not scaring anybody. <laughs> they thought that shit would work. Your breast smells. Your breast smells. Yo, this is crazy, bro. What the hell, bro? Wow. She thought she ate that too. She kept going, kept whispering. The whispers got louder. She's like, maybe if I whisper enough, they'll get scared and just hang up. I don't know, bro. Something. I don't think the mom is off the hook for some reason because like mind you like they called that same number bro that's the same number that they called i don't know like is the child using the mom's phone or like what is it i feel like the mom not off the hook bro not saying it couldn't have been the kid but the mom not off the hook for me not for me i feel like it's just gonna be a mystery on who catfish for real but saying you and your friends or whomever can stop contacting me about this like how can you how can you just demand niggas tonight not contact you about like what if they didn't know yet I just demand you niggas to leave me alone about it. And it's like, as an adult, I'm sure to some extent you know that catfishing, it can have some bad side effects too. What if some people are still dealing with those side effects? Like, what if she had relationships and they just want closure or they want to know what happened? I don't know, bro. I don't know, bro. It's just given like, you know, like, no one wants to stress, be stressed out about some shit, especially something that a child done. But you can't just act like she didn't cause damage or that there might not still be some like, I guess, backlash or maybe somebody will message you else about it. I don't know. We just assuming that it's not the mom, but I feel like there's no real proof that it's not not the mom because how did she get the phone is she using the mom's phone you know what the situation's over with they deleted the accounts they're not catfishing as her anymore as we know and shit it seemed like the real girl got some closure from it that's all i have to say about that situation and man Psst.